come and shock and all present three premier rounds in the amateur well welterweight division and in the red corner making his debut weighing in at 166.4 pounds representing manhattan's mma in chichester darren bushby And his opponent fights in the blue corner, making his debut, weighing in at 169 pounds, representing Jim one in Portsmouth, by way of Poland, Pavel Paczakowski! Your referee in charge of the action, Mr. Rich Mitchell. No nonsense, Rich Mitchell giving final instructions for getting this amateur welterweight contest underway. Darren Bushby in the black with red trim. Pavel Paschakowski in the short black trunks. Nice jab to start things off there from Bushby. Bushby ducking under that shot. Looking to lock his man up here against the cage. Yeah, I'm expecting Bushby to be really comfortable on the ground should it go there. Uh, being from Mad Hatter's gym, Jack McGee, very good pedigree of jiu-jitsu from that team. And uh, as I say it, he's, he's looking to, he's passed, he's passed guard already. Like a hot knife through butter there, Darren Bushby. Pashakowski looking to get his guard back. <laughs> Going bananas <laughs> from the bottom there. Yeah, he went a little bit Donkey Kong there. Both fighters making their debuts this evening, I believe. Paschakowski, 26 years old. Darren Bushby, just 24. 
So, um, Patrzkowski, sorry. <laughs> Could you educate me on his surname again, please? Patrzkowski. Patrzkowski. <laughs> Thank you, Bradley. Um, I, I would say that um, he seems to be striking a lot from the bottom in this position, when really what he should be doing is trying to get his guard back. There is no strike here that's going to do anything to anybody um, in this position. So he should be trying to get his guard back. If his feet are near the, the fence, he should be trying to push off a little bit. Um, that being said, Bushby clearly has great control and pressure from the top, so it's not the easiest thing to do at this point. But I would give up on the striking. Yeah, it could just be a case of frustration from him there. He's got a lot of adrenaline pumping and I just wants to, to let loose. But as you say, he, he's being controlled. He's being shut down at this moment in time. Now looking to make a move to be very careful here. He needs to get his back on the cage, which he does. Great work from Pavel Pasiakowski there. Yeah, I can see this is what he wants, a standing, standing war. Taking some shots though. Although looking very relaxed. Keeping that head moving. Quite a, a jerky, unorthodox movement style that he's got there. He's looking to throw his man off. Ooh. Give him a <laughs> quick trim there. Yeah. <laughs> so what was the end of the round with Pashikowski grinning like a wild man over in the corner there. Clearly having the time of his life. Yeah, still looking very much in the fight. But did look much more comfortable towards the end of the round there when he was able to get back to his feet. Yeah, Patrzkowski, a um, little bit of an unorthodox style. You know, a little bit of showboating going on. Um, you know, but, but very aggressive. You know, those kicks, he's putting everything into those kicks and he, he scored quite a lot of them. I think uh, Bushby seems, you know, really composed in there and he's picking his man off a few times. Time for the next round. Pasiakowski with a bit of a mountain to climb after that first round perhaps. He's going to want to put something on the board here. Opens up with some nice leg kicks to start the second. to try and pummel in there and stop this takedown. Yeah, Pachkowski is un as unorthodox as this when he gets take taken down there. Um, as unorthodox as his style is, he was very upright, which leaves him open for the takedown like this. Looking to pass that guard again now is Darren Bushby. Team telling him to go for it there. For the shoulder slams. Vintage Vandalo Silva going on there. Yeah, it all counts. It all adds up. And it looks like a pass from Bushby. Nice pass. Full melt. With the hips down and the hooks in. We heard Rich Mitchell say you'll have to pass or use some ground and pound. He's going to keep that position. Bushby passed and said, Is, is that okay? <laughs> Did exactly what he was told there. Looking to create some space there and get something behind these shots again. She's using that shrug slam type motion to just try and create a little bit of space. Oh, takes the back in one smooth movement. Darren Bushby, slick as you like. Trying to search out the rear naked choke, flattens his man out. Yeah. Teeing off with some big shots from the back. Bushby in a great position here. He's got great control, riding the back well. You know, flattening his man out. Pachkowski's really gonna have to work now to, to get back to a better position. 
if he can, he should really get a two-on-one uh, on the arm or perhaps even just roll to the side. Took a big shot to the back of the head there. And Pashakowski just being sent to a neutral corner while referee Rich Mitchell explains to Darren Bushby the error of his ways. You know, we'll often see fighters try and turn their head to draw a foul, but that wasn't the case there. It, it was a pretty much a straight shot to the back of the head. Yeah. It doesn't look like the referee's going to take a point at this juncture. It, yeah, I mean, he has to be careful. I, I doubt it was malicious, but no, he does have to be careful. Uh, absolutely not. And I think it's, you know, it's, it's a fair action from Rich Mitchell then to... to the cost in the position rather than taking the point. Yeah, spot on, spot on refing. Oh, nice single leg there. Beautiful stuff. And nice pass from Bushby. Yeah, Bushby's guard passing really has been one of the major stories of this fight so far. He's really been able to have his way in terms of where he wants the fight on the ground. Looking to perhaps get a couple of big licks off before the buzzer, not able to. Pashakowski keeps him at bay. And I think the referee just checking up on him again with that blow to the back of the head. Neither man opting for the stool before the third and final round. Yeah, so looking at the replay, uh, here, as I was saying earlier, he's very upright, Pachkowski. So it kind of leaves you open. I mean, his defence with, with his hands high is good, but it leaves you open for a, for a double or single. Um, and it, so it's, it's really important he doesn't stay too high up, or at least, or at least have a real heavy sprawl if it comes in. You know. <laughs> Pashikowski <laughs> just making sure the do is in fine form as a man who's got his priorities straight. Well, he's having fun. <laughs> and why not? Saturday night in a giant glass pyramid having a fight. <laughs> what more is there to want? Exactly. Again, finds himself defending the takedown here, does Pashakowski. Able to turn his man onto the cage. Oh, nice. Ooh. Rapid combination from Pashakowski. Targeting those shots to the side of the head. He tries to defend the takedown, but he can't. It, yeah, at this point, you know, this is where you kind of give up on the on the shot and and defend the takedown. I can see a cut. I can see some blood here. I think Bushby's got cut in that flurry that, off the cage. Yeah, it looks to be cut. Perhaps just on the bridge of the nose there, or, or on the eyebrow. Doesn't look like it's. Going to be the kind of cut that, that stops the fight at this point. You see the referee taking a, a close look at it there, but he's happy for it to continue at this stage. I believe it's his left eyelid from what I can see. It doesn't look that great from, from, from what I can see, if I'm honest. Could well be the referee's waiting for a break in the action, maybe to stand them up rather than, than costing him the position here. Yeah. And Pachkowski knows this, he, you know, he's hammering away at that eye. That's well, essentially a, you know, a big red target once you've spotted it. Well, this is where his striking from the bottom is effective because he's working on the cut. And we are going to see a timeout here. Mm. And the doctor... He's being brought into the cage. Fighter safety, very important. And yeah, that's, that, that's a big cut. Yeah. Just between the brow and the eyelid. Um, some great reffing. Really good reffing. Perfect timing to stop that fight. 
Uh, Rich is one of the best in the game. He, he referees on, on the biggest shows in, in England and, and further afield as well. Refereed for the UFC, of course. Okay, they're going to continue. That's great. That's great news. Doctor says it's it's all good. So the fight continues. <laughs> and immediately, Pashikowski going to work. Bushby's going to look to, to, to control the legs and maybe throw them to the side and pass. Or knee slides. Not nice. Oh, great stuff. And Bushby into side control. Pashikowski still punching from the bottom. Pashikowski, only thing I would say is there's not really been any attempt to try and stand up from, from the bottom. So, you know, is, and, and not get his guard back e either. So there's maybe something he can work on. Um, for the next fight. Looking for a knee on belly briefly there was Darren Bushby. Final few seconds of the fight. Went for a, a north-south, was it? I'm not entirely sure what he was going for there, but certainly switched around for some kind of choke. And a great show of respect between these two young men after a fair old ding-dong. Yeah, it looked like, I think at the end there, it was almost like a dash choke he was going for in the end. He kind of moved around after the bell just to show that it could have been there. Uh, a great fight. I really liked it. You know, good, good clash of styles again. Uh, yeah, I, I mean, it, I, I was really impressed by both fighters in that. Pachikowski, very entertaining as well. Absolutely. And, you know, that, that, that's not an understated part of the game. You know, if fighters want to make money, They've got to have a following. They've got to be entertaining. They've got to give people a reason to watch them fight other than just winning. You know, you, you can do fine just winning fights, but if you look at the people who make the serious money in this game, it's always been those polarizing guys, the guys you, are, you either really love them or you find them obnoxious, but either way, you're going to pay your money to see them fight. And that's exactly what we've got uh, with Pashikowski here. Exactly. Well, regardless, we'll throw it to our MC, Ricky Wright in the cage. We'll make this one official. Ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of action, we've had to go to the judges' scorecards. All three judges scored about 29-28 in favour of your winner by unanimous decision. In the red corner, Darren Bushby! And let's cheer for your runner-up, Pavel Patrykovsky. Ladies and gentlemen, we're about to take a short 10-minute break, so do what you gotta do. I'll be back in 10 minutes time for the rest of tonight's card. <laughs>